So, you know, where this 3D work comes from, the, the, the paintings themselves are, are based on the mathematics of and, uh, map making. And, um, but of course, a map is a 2D surface. And one of the things you can do with a 2D surface, of course, is to fold it and deform it. And so that starts to bring in concepts that come from origami, which is, is itself its own mathematical system. Mm -hmm. So we're now incorporating both maps and origami. So can and you talk about what you're going to do to this um, 3D object? So what's really great about it, if you think about it, it really is a two-dimensional flat surface that's been folded around mm -hmm. this three-dimensional frame. And so what we can do is we can fold it, we can unfold it, we can combine it, we can, we can do it partially folded and partially unfolded, we can completely do the map and then re-deform, re-mold the mm -hmm. shapes around mm -hmm. something else okay. and see how they come out. So, it's really, it's just the idea of taking a two-dimensional surface and bending it around something, hmm. which of course is something that a map is. And you... And you could make the configuration into anything, anything that you want, anything that was, mm -hmm. uh, anything that I'm curious about. So when you mentioned Anne Truitt, what was, was that kind of tongue-in-cheek or was there some... No, I mean, I, specifically I'm thinking of Anne Truitt because the form reminds me of Anne Truitt. But I think yes. Anne Truitt is really very much about, a, even though she's a sculptor and mm -hmm. made things, in a way she's someone who, she's not someone who is like a sculptor and a painter. She, I would call her someone who works in like two and a half dimensions. Interesting. Because what she does is she takes a two-dimensional surface and bends it around something. So it's like a folded two-dimensional surface. It's not a fully three-dimensional surface. It's a bent okay. or transformed two-dimensional surface. So in many ways, she's, she's in my mind, mm -hmm. I think of her as a, not so much a sculptor, as a painter who works in 3D. Okay, thank you. Yeah.